happy to have you aboard. Wherever you've locked us in across the UNM Sports Radio Network tonight, Will McNair Jr. jumping center for the Aggies here this evening. We're set for basketball. It's in the air. Mooskin in first off the floor. Tapped it in the backcourt to our left, and here we go. House with the goatee through the center circle with a between the legs bounce. Off the Mooskin and ball screen, brings it angle left beyond the arc. 20 to shoot. Flashes to Johnson at the top. Now dribble hand off to Todd. Todd driving hard down the left rail. He's cut off. Kicks it out to Johnson. 10 to shoot now. Johnson down the right rail. Knocks the New Mexico State Aggie down. And a player control foul has been called. McKinney draws the charge. A whistle on Johnson, his first personal. I think a feather would have knocked him down. <laughs> Could have been our first flop warning. I think that was, that was an opportunity. He could have had a flop call right there. Warning, number one. Mario McKinney, Jr. from St. Louis, Missouri, on ball with a white headband into the front court for the Aggies. Lobs it to the high post here to McNair. Dribble hand off to their point guard, Rice. Back left wing high to McCants. Drop it on the block now, left side to the big fella. McNair trying to turn through. Muskinen and Muskinen blocks it. A valley fence. Block hunger donation to the Roadrunner Food Bank. Match sprint across yeah. the timeline the that other time, way. Muskinen was just straight up and down. Didn't fall for any head fakes. Muskin had just had it stripped. A nice reach in by McNair as Jethro put it on the deck from the free throw circle turnover. Changes in three on the way for the Aggies. Come the short from the right wing. That awkward set shot of Teddy Allen and a <laughs> rebound to UNM. Todd across the timeline. Todd down the lane line. Todd kicks it out. How straight on three. Left iron no good. McNair clears for New Mexico State. I like how Todd is getting into the paint with his ball penetration. The Aggies looking for someone else to do something with the ball in his hands other than Jabari Rice today. Rice had to pretty much take care of all the ball handling and the scoring in the backcourt for the Aggies a week ago. Step back, Jay. Angle left for Rice is an air ball off of one leg from 17 feet. Grab weak side by House. House gets it quickly ahead to Tovar. Excuse me, to Todd in the left corner. Back out front now to House with 20 to shoot. Muskin in screens. House wants a three. Back rim, no good. Rebound way up in the air, and McNair climbs over Mushkin and declared for New Mexico State. Allen will walk it through the center circle for the Aggies. He's their top scorer. Allen backs it out into Lobo's shield. Logo crosses over on Todd, takes it right down the lane. He leaves it off, and a bunny missed from the baseline left by McNair, and a loose ball foul on the weak side goes on to Mexico State. Yeah, McCants with the loose ball over the top of Johnson. Johnson putting the body on him. That's great box out yep. by Javante. Yep. He's been the, the Lobos' most voracious rebounder all year, Hunter. And McNance's foul trouble really cost his team a week ago in Cruces. Still scoreless, 17.40 to go here first half from the pit. Crossover dribble by House. Had it stripped, got it back. Gets it into the corner to Mash. Mash drives the baseline. Mash to the reverse. Spins it in off the square. Mash burn scores. Lobos up 2-0. Like that ball penetration. The guards using their quickness. Get to the hole. Mash said that his signature yellow Nikes, they were breaking down, Hunter, so that's why he's got these brand new cherry kicks tonight. A spin dribble into the key for the Aggies, and a oh. miss there by McKinney, and another rejection for New Mexico. Another Valley Fence block hunger donation. There's House in transition. He knocks down the three ball. That's defense to offense, and the Lobos convert the block shot into a big hoop on the three. All started with Muscadin with a block, almost looked like he blocked it twice. Muskinen with two blocks early on. The Western Sky buckets for bucks donation on the three, and a nice take there by McKinney to the rim to bank it in off the square. The Aggies on the board, it's five to two Lobos. 16.40 to go, first half. Slow, high, right hand bounce for House into the front court. Muskinen screens for Jalen, he steps back, had to three, decided not to. Baseline drive by Mashburn. Leaves it off for Muskinen. Right hand jump hook, no good. Rebounded by the Aggies. Here comes McKinney up the near wing. McKinney into the front court. Euro step. Pass deflected by Terran Todd, but Rice got it. Out high it comes to McCann. Shifted angle right to Allen. Allen into the key. Allen drops it off for the big fella. And McNair scores over Todd. Actually, it was pretty good defense. Got to give credit to the big fella down low. McNair. Five to four Lobos. Pryor's going to check in. Pryor 
Came back a couple of games back off a hip flexor. Baseline drive here by House. He's tripped up, able to keep his feet. Foul on the floor or on the shot? We'll see when we come back on the other side. The whistle's going to go on McKinney. They'll call it a trip, and it uh, looks like it is on the floor. It didn't indicate two shots. It'll be on the floor. 15.53 to go in the first half. Lobo's five. The next goes stay four. Lobo ball on the other side of the break. Lobo basketball of UNM Sports Radio Network. Head to the place you call home across New Mexico. And that's the power of we in action. Visit newsetter.org slash impact to learn more. Lobo trying to get it inside, and Mashburn loses it out of bounds. It was last touched by the Aggies. It'll stay with UNM. There was a lot of contact there as Mashburn's no foul call. 15 to shoot for UNM. House inbounding under the bucket. Did for the first time for New Mexico. House gets it from the man he inbounded to and brings it out high. Eight to shoot. Tovar screens for House. House crossing over. House skip pass left corner. Open lefty three on the way for Todd. Front iron and no good rebound for Nate Pryor for the Aggies. In transition, they try to lob it in and it's deflected beautifully by Johnson and Tovar as McCants goes hard to the deck. Lobos headed the other way. Pull up Jay from Ashburn. Comes up short left wing from 17 feet. And we've got... An injury on yeah. McCants here. He's holding his right hand. Yeah, he's got that uh, look like his index finger taped, and uh, he's grabbing it and grimacing as he goes to the bench. Fifteen minutes and ten seconds as the Aggies take possession. McCants has left because of the finger. They enter it to McCants. Excuse me, to McNair, another Lobo rejection, but a loose basketball finds Peak, and Peak lays it in. And the Aggies go up six to five. They've scored six in a row. Peak, six seven, athletic guy. I saw him in warm was just dunking everything. Tough runner there by House. I think the ball even snuck down onto his palm, Hunter, but he still lofted it high over McNair, got and that, it went it over the front got iron. Got that Lobo rim. 7-6 Lobos, 14-35 and winding your first half. Crossover bounce by Allen and a handoff to Pryor. Pryor's from Seattle, Washington against House Hugh. House fights over top of the screen. They get it to Allen on the wing. He's guarded by Ty. Allen is such a tough cover at his size, 6-7. Yeah. Backing up, straight on three off the step back. Short, rebounded by Jay Allen. Tovar and a whistle is going to go on Peak. Peak picks up his first personal for New Mexico State. Tovar. Kind of taking off where he left up in the last game. I think that's his second rebound. Tovar coming off the 15.11 rebound double-double on Tuesday. Mountain Dew's a proud partner of the Lobos. Cheers to Lobos and their fans everywhere. We are New Mexico. 14-10 and clicking. Remaining here in the first half is to fit. Lobos 7, Aggie 6. Mashburn gives it up to House. House at the top. House crossing over, kicks left corner. Alan Tovar's three is blocked by Peak. Loose basketball finds Yuat Alak. Alak is checked in on the post for McNair. Now, Rice driving. Rice feeds Peak, and there's a bank shot that catches no iron. Rebounded backside by Todd. Todd will bring it into the front court for New Mexico on his own. Handed off to Mashburn on the left wing. Mashburn with a beautiful ball fake. He rises for a 15-foot elbow, Jay. It's too strong, and a loose ball foul has been called. I think they're going to get UNM here. Taryn Todd's first. Saquon Singleton's first ever appearance on the pit floor. Think about that. He played an entire season a year ago, Hunter, and didn't never played a game in Albuquerque. And it's probably why he came here, right? Kids come here because they want to play in the pit. K.J. Jenkins hasn't played in a couple of games. In fact, only played a couple of minutes on Thanksgiving. Missed the entirety of the next game on Black Friday. Missed the entirety of the game in Cruces. Jenkins has been nursing an ankle. So after three games with only four minutes of court time, K.J. returns. Aggies get it to the baseline. This is Teddy Allen. He leans in over Singleton. His shot comes up short. Loose basketball is grabbed by Alok, and he scores on the step back. That's what the Aggies do. They crash the offensive glass. Mexico State back in front, 8-7. Crossover oh. dribble by House. They're going to call House for a player control foul as an Aggie goes hard into the stanchion underneath the bucket. I can see where House could get whistled for that. He, he put the shoulder right into the defender. And 
That was the reason why he got called for the, the first on House is the third on the Lobos, and it's Nate Pryor who went down hard underneath the basket. The Lobo five right now, it's House, Jenkins, Tovar, Muskinen, and Singleton for UNM. Thanks for finding us this evening, wherever you've locked us in yeah. on the UNM Sports Radio Network. It's a privilege to have you for such an important game for both programs. It always is so big when these two schools get together, Hunter. Yeah, looking down at the other end, it looked like Peak hurt his left knee. He's going to sit out. We'll also keep you updated on Pryor as well, because Pryor is the one who went very hard into the stanchion under the bucket after taking that charge. He has left the game for the Aggies as well. They have Allen, McKinney, Rice, McCants at A-Lock. House picked him clean, and it's off of McKinney's hands and out of bounds. The Lobos are the Steels leader in the Mountain West 61, Conference for their baby. first eight games, <laughs> and House is the master thief. They've got a total of 61 leading the Mountain West Conference in Steels. Singleton at the top here with 24 on the timer. Gets it to House, baseline left. Skip pass, right wing high to Jenkins. Gadget you triple. It's short. Rebound to New Mexico State. Allen pulled to Karam. He'll bring it across himself. Allen checked out high by Singleton. Allen to transfer from Nebraska. Started his career at West Virginia. There's a steal by Singleton. Can the Lobos get out and run? The Aggies appear to get back, but they leave KJ alone. Shot fake, KJ steps to his left, buries the three from the right corner. Jenkins puts the Lobos up 10 to eight. And another three point donation, courtesy of Western Sky Community Care, into buckets for Bucks campaign. There's McKinney at the top to big hands on the left wing. His open three, back rim no good. Singleton way up there for a loose ball, and it's off of the Aggies, it'll go off of Allen out of bounds. New Mexico ball, the love the way Saquon crashed the glass there. You know, the Lobos really can use his length coming from the wing on that weak side. Singleton. Marcellus Avery from Richmond, Virginia, 6'8", freshman checks in for the Aggies. Basketball's better with a crisp Bud Light at your game. Keep it crisp, Lobos, please drink responsibly. Singleton has it in front of Chris Jans and the Aggie bench. To the left wing now to House, about 30 feet from the goal. He refuses the screen, skips it right wing to Jenkins. Jenkins three off the left iron, rebounded by McKitty. McKitty with a long pass, three quarters court into the cheerleaders over the head of McCants. An Aggie turnover, Lobos 10, New Mexico State 8, 11.48 to go in the first half. Don't go away. Lobo basketball on the UNM Sports Radio. We're back courtside on Albertson's Radio Row inside the pit, 10 to 8. Lobos at the 11.48 mark. Your neighborhood supermarket is Albertson's Market, where service selection and savings matter. The official fan and tailgate headquarters to Lobos is Albertson's Market. So New Mexico is up 10 to 8. Both teams struggling to find the bottom of the net. 27% floor shooting for the Aggies, 31% for the Lobos. New Mexico has had some good three-point looks on her, but they're just two of eight. Yeah, no, both teams kind of settling in. But you know what? Credit the defense of both teams. Mashburn on the ball for UNM. Brief rest, it looks like, for House. Singleton drives the left lane line. Right-hand runner from the left block, a little short for Saquon. Rebound to the Aggies. Rice ahead. Rice through the Mountain West logo. Rice's shot is blocked from behind, but he draws Kanch up his first team sport. Javante Johnson will check back in for UNM. He is Sir Jabari Rice. We talked to him in Las Cruces Center, and he said that's his given name. That's what the, the name his mom gave him, but it has always been shortened to Jabari his entire career. He finally got a sports information director at New Mexico State to yeah, make the change yeah. officially on the roster. So there you go. He that's missed the, last, the first free that's throw. That's the last, line, last time we're going to mention it. Done. <laughs> Yeah, no, he, that Once Lobo rim, you see it. that? You see that Lobo rim? It spits the ball out when the Aggies exactly. shoot it, and it softly gathers it when the Lobos shoot it. Rice's second free throw is good. 10-9, to nine, New Mexico leads. State showing a little full court trap here. 1-2-1. Yep. Two, one. One. yep. One, two, one, one. yep. Ahead it comes to Johnson. Johnson finds Muskin on the baseline. Out high, open three from Ashburn on the way. Yes! There's a big one. Assist Muskin in. Three ball from Ashburn. Lobos 13, Aggies 9. Another Western Sky Buckets for Bucks donation. Open in the corner is Rice as Mashburn went down hard. 
and Nash is still on the floor. Looks like he's grabbing his growing area. Nash might have taken a shot to one of the more sensitive areas. Yep. He's up and walking. He is definitely feeling it, yep. though. And Nash is OK. Yep. You can see him purse his lips, though, and go, ooh, you mm -hmm. could tell that one. He really felt it. Put some ice on it later. Oof. 13 to 9, New Mexico <laughs> leads. OK, <laughs> let's leave that subject now. 11th minute mark, first half. Aggie ball, front court, 16 on the shot timer. Just a brief stoppage for a moment as Singleton and Avery were kind of locked up. The officials want to make sure this one doesn't get out of hand. They get it to Rice up the inbound, right elbow extended. Crosses over our McCants uh, screen. Now left wing to Pryor. Pryor with a right hand bounce, working on KJ. Five seconds to shoot to Rice. Rice lost it at center court. He'll shoot a 35-footer. It's an air ball. That's a great 30-second sequence on defense for the that's Lobos. Right. And that's solid defense in a half court by the Lobos. Mashburn controlling the point with House getting a breather on the Lobo bench to make you up 13 to 9. Can tell you early in the week, House did tweak the ankle that's been bugging him, but he's just fine. Baseline jumper by Muskin and no good. There's Javante there Johnson is. crashing the offensive glass and laying it in on the stick back. Sophomore Johnson just giving you nothing but 10 and 5. The Lobos' toughest rebounder, number one in the stat sheet and number one in effort. McCants leaning in on Johnson, can't convert. I think Muskinen might have gotten a fingertip on it. And it's off the fingers of McNair and out of bounds. Lobo ball to make you up by six. You like how Muskinen is changing shots inside. Guys are head faking, thinking twice. Where is he? Jalen House checks back in for UNM. So Johnson, Mashburn, House, Muskinen, and Singleton for the Lobos. Ten minute mark here, first tap. Mashman on the left wing beyond the arc. Crossing over to the baseline. Pulls up, 18-footer. It's an air ball. Singleton scores on the stick back. Chance burn in one for Saquon. The Lobos are trashing the offensive glass. The weak side. That's Singleton crashing in a stick back. Don't see Mash throw up an air ball too often, but Singleton was right there. He draws contact from Avery. Avery's first is the team's fourth. And Avery's going to check out. Substitution for the Aggies as they get LeVar Williams. And LeVar Williams. Massachusetts native, 6'1 yeah. sophomore. He'll check in. And he can shoot the three. In fact, I'm not even sure he's even attempted a two-point field goal. Singleton knocks down a free throw. That's big. He's a 50% foul shooter. Singleton gets the old-fashioned oh. three-point play. Lobos up 18-9. to nine. New Mexico scored eight in a row. Oh, nice Backdoor cut by Pryor. He lost the basketball. And Muskinen steals it away. Lobos in transition, Singleton in the front court, Singleton into the key, Singleton leans in, banks it too strong, got it back, missed on the oh. stick back. Muskinen has the ball bounce off his head, and Johnson chases down the loose ball. Skips it left wing to house, deep wing three, short. Rebounded by Allen for New Mexico State. Oh, what a sequence. Allen presses tempo. Allen nearly traveled with it. It's last touch by Singleton. UNM off of Singleton's hands. A lot of action in that position. Lobos got a couple of point blank looks and yeah. couldn't convert. Peak checks back in thought, for the Aggies. Excuse me, almost thought Singleton kind of threw it up at the backboard to go get it, to get a better shot. That's a Shaquille O'Neal ploy. <laughs> I think he That's used to do that just to dunk on your head. Peak catches the inbound. Peak nearly had it stripped. Gets it out to the wing. Allen on the take against Singleton. Rises for a baseline J. And the screwball goes in. Did you see the rotation <laughs> on that thing? A 16-foot pull-up jumper that was twisting sideways. <laughs> a swish, though. That snaps the 8-0 Lobo run. The next up by seven. House on the left wing. House off the Muskinen screen to the top of the circle. His wing pass stolen away. Allen on the anticipation. Allen against House. Allen to the rim and lays it in. 18-13. Lobo lead is down to five. Mashburn off the screen. Mashburn into the key. Hesitation dribble. Throws it out high to Muskinen. Jethro back to Mash on the left wing. Wide open three. Yes, sir. Mash is buried two. Lobos by eight. I like to see that ball movement. Oh, inside out. High ball screen. Roll. Mashburn. 
Wonderful gotcha. balance scoring for the Lobos so far as well. Allen, step back triple deep from the left wing, and it rattles around and out. Rebound, Javante Johnson. Lobos have numbers. It's a four on two. Gets it ahead on the bounce of Muskinen. Jeff Brown leads it in. Lobos by 10, their biggest lead, 23 to 13 in the pit. Reward the big fella for running the floor. Peek has it on the baseline, right on the block. Muskinen on his back. Jethro tapped it away. Timeout on court. Aggie ball on the other side. Lobos in control early. 7.49 to go in the first half. 23 to 13 UNM. Lobo basketball on the UNM Sports Radio Network. We're back court side in the pit on Albertson's Radio Row. 7.49 to go in the first half. Lobos 23, Aggies 13. TLC wants to thank customers for trusting TLC with home and business service needs. TLC here for you when you need us most. Go Lobos. Back with Lobo all-time great, Hunter Green. I'm Robert Fornoy. Hunter, how has UNM pushed this lead out to 10, its biggest margin? Well, they've been knocking down shots. I mean, that's really, and then, you know, this, uh, on the defensive end, getting stops. Aggie ball, 19 to shoot as they inbound in the front court. Throw it out high to Williams. Williams lost it, chased it down at the center line. I think House got away with a foul there. Now to Allen on the right wing. Allen working off a ball screen has a smaller mash burn on him on the switch now. Allen gets it out for a deep three by Peak, and it's his second make of the game. A two-point goal and a three-point goal. Five points off the bench for Coach Jans. Lobos 23, Aggie 16. Mashburn to Todd on the right wing near the Bob King Court logo. Taryn between the circles, crossing over, down the left rail against Allen, stripped and fouled. That's a rise, that's gotta be a shooting foul, and Taryn will tow the line. I think uh, Allen saw the scouting report, but Todd is, you don't wanna do that. So the first on Allen is the fifth on New Mexico State, and Taryn Todd at the foul line. And the lefty's first free throw is up, and off the left iron. He'll get another. Todd, a very productive night in 17 minutes on Tuesday in Las Cruces. Eight points, three assists, two steals. Went eight of 10 at the foul line. Did not make a field goal. 0 for two at the stripe on this visit. Second miss rebounded by New Mexico State. Lobo lead stands at seven, 23 to 16. Rice with the ball in his hands for NMSU to Allen. Allen whipped it inside and McCann scores and he's fouled. That's what you don't want to happen. No time. Muscadin was just a little late getting there defensively. So, Muskinen's first, that's the team's fifth, fifth on UNM, and Johnny McCants to the strike. McCants went to Anyate High School in Las Cruces, his free throw off the right iron, but a rebound for Peak, and a miss you, gets another clock to the right wing of Williams. Now out top to Allen, Allen with a left hand drive. His right hand runner, no good from the left side of the key. Rebound to Todd, the Lobos have it. House into the front court. House crossing over. House spinning and stepping back. House had it stripped. Nice defense there by Peak. Loose basketball finds the Aggies. New Mexico State possession. Lobo lead is five, 23 to 18. Here's Rice. Rice has the big on him. Gives it up to Williams instead. Williams rises for a deep three. Rattles out. Rebound, Muscadet. And a foul away from the ball. It'll be Peak. Peak's second as he and Todd got tangled up. Route 66, proud to be an official sponsor of the Lobos. Get your kicks only at Route 66 Casino Hotel. 23-18, UNM, 6-19 remaining here in the first, ha first half, and the Lobos will be making substitutions. Jay Allen Tovar once in for UNM. It'll be... Tovar, House, Mashburn, Todd, and Mushkin for UNM. Allen, Rice, McNair, Williams, and McCants for the Mexico State. House off the Mushkin and ball screen. Tries to split defenders and a reach in foul. It's going to be on New Mexico State. They're going to get McCants his second. Well, the last couple of trips down, they've been trapping on House. House has to be aware of that. The defense is coming and collapsing on him once he gets in that painted area. That's the seventh teamer on the Aggies. The Lobos will have six minutes of free throws here at the end of the first half. If it's anything like the last contest, 
head to Mexico State, it could turn into a free throw shooting yep. contest. The Lobos won that part of the battle last week. Fouls total between the both of them. Yeah. House missed only one foul shot last week at the Pan Am Center. He went 10 of 11. This is the front end of a one-on-one -on -one here. Needs the first to get the second, and he knocks it down. Jalen House at 82% on the year from the foul line. Shoots the most free throws on the team. Came in averaging 18 points. Johnson checks in. Muskinen checks out for UNM. That puts J. Allen Tovar at the five with this group on the floor for UNM. Second free throw is good for Jalen House. And the Lobos up 25 to 18. Seven point New Mexico advantage. McKinney on ball for NOSU. Refuses the screen, brings it left wing high. Now off the screen, down the right lane line, spinning, firing left handed, rejected by Jay Allen Tovar. Another Valley Fence block hunger donation to the Roadrunner Food Bank. House nearly lost the dribble. Keeps it alive, Harlem Globetrotter style. And lays it in. Jalen House, a magician with the ball. Give him nine. Lobos lead it 27 to 18. And a timeout taken by New Mexico State. House is a fly in the ointment. Proverbial pest, <laughs> isn't he, Hunter, as a defender? Because he takes chances, and with risk comes great reward. Yeah, no, he does. And he gets his hands on a lot of balls. Deflections are huge for House. Not only does he steal it, but you know when he doesn't steal it, he's disrupting. Five forty-seven left till the break. Coach Jans has taken his use it or lose it thirty for NMSU. He returned to the bench for the Aggies in their last game a couple of nights back when they beat their interstate rival at UTEP on a rice three with just over a second left. Jans had missed a couple of games because of COVID, including the loss to UNM on Tuesday last week. Here's Williams on the left wing with 18 to shoot. He'll get it left block here to McNair. McNair kicks it out to the right wing to Allen. Allen on the take. Allen to the rim. Right hand score. You don't want him. Yeah, Allen, don't get him started. Loves to use that ball penetration. Get to the bucket. Last time he shot 12 free throws against the Lobos. I'd rather overplay the drive and let him shoot that weird yes. looking three. Lobos by seven. Five Ted left. First half, 27 to 20. Alan Tobar's left all alone. Misses the straight on three, way up to rebound. Oh, is, is Rice, and it was stolen by Jenkins, but KJ couldn't keep the handle. Loose ball finds an Aggie near midcourt. It's Nate Pryor, he's checked back in. Remember, he's the one who hit the stanchion really hard. Good to see he's okay. Crossover dribble by Allen. He's doubled off the bounce, gives it up on the baseline. Goes to get it back now on the Bob King court logo. Back right corner to Rice. Rice has Nash on him, five to shoot. A screen for Rice. Rice to the elbow. Look for the screener. Deflection by Mash on the pass. Two seconds to shoot for the Aggies. Coach Jans gives his team baseline, out of bounds play instructions. They're underneath the bucket. They need to get a shot off quickly. They'll key it in. Two seconds to shoot. Whip it into Williams. Deep three off the catch. Air ball on another shot clock violation. The Lobos have forced two of them already in the game, Hunter. Air ball chance come from the Lobo fans in the pit. The legendary venue has really filled in nicely. We we're told that just one of the suites upstairs unoccupied and the main seating bowl nearly full. Mashburn, hesitation bounce. Mashburn rises. His floater rejected by McNair. Numbers for the Aggies. They give it up and get it back, and Pryor lays it in. A nice give and go there with Rice. And Mashburn's got to be aware with the trees when you go inside. That's an easy block shot for McNair, oh, isn't it? Yeah, you just lay it right in front of him. Doesn't even have to leave his feet. Nope. Mashburn off the ball screen, but the Lobos up five. Drives hard down the right lane line. Leans in. Floater, good. Oh, a step through against Rice. So pretty. Mashburn in double figures. Lobos 29. Aggies 22. Ten points for Mash. Allen with Singleton on him. Dribble handoff to Williams. Back to Allen. Pass fake for Allen. And now he leaves it for Price. Price gets it hung up on the bottom of the backboard. Lobos take the loose ball. Singleton at the top, left wing high to House. House sends Singleton away. He wants Alan Tobar to come and screen for him. 
Backs it out, takes the screen, gets the switch, blows by McNair, lays it in. Oh, it works so perfectly. House with 11. And you like how House just looked it in as he went to the floor to make sure he made that layup. So patient, too. He waited for that screen to materialize. He didn't rush it. Bubbles by nine. Allen driving hard. Goes to the reverse, lays it in, crosses the key from left to right. Allen with eight. 31 to 24, Lobos by seven. Inside the three minutes here in the first half. Coach Patino will take his 30 second timeout. Lobos inbounding in front of our broadcast position near center court. Singleton tosses it into Jalen House. Gets it to Saquon, who hands it off to KJ Jenkins. Jenkins. At the top of the circle, off the Mexican screen, rises for a 19-footer, off the left iron, no good. KJ a little cold early, did make one three. Remember, he's been out for three games. Rice driving for New Mexico State. They're going to call a blocking foul on KJ Jenkins. Sixth teamer on UNM, first on KJ. Next one means Aggie free throws. We have two and a half minutes to go in the first half. 31 to 24, Lobos. Pryor looks to key it in. Throws it way out front to McNair between the circle. Pryor goes to get it, and they have 20 to shoot. Pryor in his sheets. Waits for the McNair screen. House fights over top. Now to Rice, left wing beyond the arc. Jab step on Mashburn. Rice is for three, got it. Tough shot over Mashburn. Rice's shot probably, what, three inches? Shot Definitely right the height advantage on Mash. 31 to 27, Lobo lead is four, two minute mark, first half. Mash catches from Saquon, way out high. Mushkin and screens, Mash down the rail, Mash to the reverse, can't curl it in. Loose ball to Bryant. New Mexico State will push. Rice, shot fake in transition, finds the cutting out. Back to Rice, wide open wing three, rims out. Rebounded by Muskinen. Both Saquon Singleton and Muskinen could have grabbed that carom for the Lobos. Down to a minute and a half left in the first half. Lobos have been up by 10. House on the take. Oh, and the layup rattles out. Rebounded by Allen. Allen going one on one on Singleton, and he traveled with it. Too many steps. Tried the Euro step. Took there, one was a, there was a Lobo standing there to take a charge. Way to get back. Lobos led by Jalen House's 11 points. Mashburn with 10 as well. Two and double figures for UNM. Singleton sits. Johnson checks in for the Lobos for the final 123. Allen's eight points. That leads New Mexico State. Peak second high score for the Aggies with five on the bench. Lobos shooting it 38% from the field. The Aggies 40. This is Jenkins between the wheels. Left wing high now to House. Dribble hand up to Mashburn as they exchange spots. Kick it over the right wing. Jenkins three ball off the left iron. Loose basketball on the floor. Johnson won it in a foul on New Mexico State. Johnson will toe the line. Mar Williams, and his first man? team's eight. Johnson always around the ball. He's really Johnny on the spot yeah. right now. Hustle plays, right? Making all the hustle plays for the Logos. Front end of a one-on-one -on -one for Johnson here. 74% foul shooter. First one, rattles out. Rebounded by Allen. One minute to go. We're at the end of the first down. Lobos by four. Allen with the smaller Mashburn guarding him. We'll cross over on Mash into the free throw circle. To the left wing now to Pryor. Backs it out with House checking him. 12 to shoot. Crosses over on House, keeps it left corner. Shot fake there by Avery, steps in. Misses an 18 footer. Three pound Saquon Singleton. 6 6 kid from the Bronx, way up above the square to grab that one. Seven seconds separating shot clock and game clock here at the end of the first half. House going to run some timer. 15 on the shot clock now. He's got the much bigger Avery on him. Should be able to take him off the dribble if he chooses. Down to eight on the shot clock. Crosses over on Avery. Kicks it right wing to Johnson. Johnson into the key. Johnson knifes inside. Oh. Can't convert. Singleton had a hand on the loose ball, but it's rebounded by the Aggies. They've got four to get a shot off. Get into the corner. Shot fake by Williams. His three from the corner. In and out. That'll do it for the first half.
Aggies have Pryor, Rice, McNair, McCants, and Allen. So Pryor starts the second half in place of the starting point guard, McKinney. And Pryor has it because he brings it to the front court. This wing pass deflected by Mashburn, but Pryor chased it back down. 20 to shoot for NMSU. Lobos guard man to man under Richard Patino. The screen for Pryor. Pryor shoots a floater. It rattles out over Muskadin. Rebound to Devontae Johnson. His fifth carom. Leads the Lobos in that category. The Lobos are gang rebounding. Five for Johnson, four for Muskadin, four for Singleton. House on ball for New Mexico. 15 to shoot. Between the legs, bounce, step back, straight on three for Jalen. Left iron, no good. Rebound prior for New Mexico State. A run out for McCants. His layup is good. Left hand, nice find by Pryor with a half court chest pass. Lobos got to get back. That time he just got beat down the court. Lobos led by as many as 10 in the first half. That lead has shrunk to two here at the start of the second half. Muskinen comes to screen for House. House to the left elbow, cut off, skips it angle right to Todd. Todd crossing over, driving baseline to the reverse, layup curls off, well defended by McCants. Even a little more English on that one, Todd did. Here's Allen, driving hard, leaving it for McNair. Layup is an air ball, rebound weak side to Johnson. Javante gets it ahead to Muskadin. He'll try a little eight-foot jump shot and scores it over McCants. Nice heads-up play by Muskadin to just jump stop and pull up that nice little 10, 12-footer. 33-29, Lobos by four. 18-15 and clicking in the game. Second half just underway from University Arena. Whip pass inside to the left block here to McNair. He's going to back down Muskadin. Try the right-hand jump hook. Well defended by Jethro. It's short. Rebound to Muskadin. Skip pass by House. Johnson, left corner, three on the way. The Lobos leading three-point shooter misses there. Came in shooting at 51.7% from deep. Aggies have it. Baseline drive for Allen and a right hand flush as he runs past Todd and dunks. 33-31, Lobos by two. Play call indicated by House for U of M. 17-35 and clicking in the game. House brings it to the left wing, splits defenders, skips it right corner. Todd steps back, could have shot the three, can still shoot the three if he wants it. Instead, he'll drive. He'll kick it left corner to House. Jalen drives, kicks it out for a Mashburn three. Used to read. Nice ball movement that time. Mashburn's third triple, another Western Sky. Community care, buckets, four bucks, donation. Lobos by five, 36-31. Lob entry to McCants on the left block. He has Muskinen on him. He'll bang into him. He'll lean in on him. And it'll be an offensive foul. Stuck the form in the chest. And picks up a player control foul. Muskinen really playing within himself tonight. Not leaving the floor. Chesting his man. The absence of Quatch. Eman played so many good minutes. More than 20 of them at the five on Tuesday. He tweaked his knee this week in practice, not available. The Lobos needed Muskidin at the five to not be emotional and stay on court today, right? And, and he's doing a great job so far. Lobos lead by five. Inside 17 minutes, here's House. Refuses the screen this time. Gets it to Todd. Taren fakes the three, drives to the left block, kicks it out, right elbow to Muskidin. Jethro put it on the deck and it was stolen away. A poke away by Pryor. Numbers here. For New Mexico State, Allen spins to the rim and lays it in. Teddy Allen with a dozen. Very unorthodox game Allen has, but very effective. Hard to guard. Todd, right down the center of the key and a bump and a foul. This one's going to be on Alok. You want Alok, the New Zealander. He's checked in on the post for McNair. Picks up his first, team second. Aggies now have Rice back on court with Pryor, Allen, Alok, and Pete. Here's House crossing over on Pryor. Lobbing it oh, there for Jethro. For Jethro can't catch with the left hand. Aggies with a run out. Allen lays it in, and another find by Pryor. And Pryor has been a great call at the start of the second half by Coach Jans. 
He's thrown two three-quarter court assists. Bubba lead is down to one, 36 to 35. UNM out to the top. Whips it to the left baseline here to Javante. Javante with a right-hand jump hook in the key from the Mountain West logo, too strong. Rebounded by Novexio State. Rice leaves it for Peak. Transition three on the way. Off the right iron, no good. Alok rebounds and scores. Aggies up 37 to 36. They've made their last four field goal attempts. New Mexico State in front by one. Lobos take timeout. 15.40 to go in the game. 37 36. New Mexico State. Lobo basketball, the UNM Sports Group. The Lobos led by five. New Mexico State has a 6 0 run working over the last 48 seconds of clock time. And they've taken the lead, 37 to 36. 15.40 to go in the game. We're on Albertson's Radio Row. Albuquerque Santa Fe Toyota dealers are proud supporters of the UNM Lobos. Visit them today or find your perfect Toyota model. Toyota, let's go places. House on ball for UNM. Johnson, Singleton, Tovar, and Mashburn. New Mexico State comes out with a little half-court trap. House takes a straight arm three off the right iron. Rebound NMSU. Allen pulled it. Allen gives it up to Pryor. Pryor whips it ahead to Rice. Open left wing three for Price. Short. Loose ball foul as it missed. Who's it on? It's going to be on Mashburn. Mashburn picks up the personal and will take timeout. 15 18 to go in the game. Mash is first, the team's first. Aggie ball on the other side. Lobos 37, uh, trailing the Aggies. It's New Mexico State 37, UNM 36 on the offense. Download the new Lobo Sports app, interviews with the head coaches, live game broadcasts, the latest stats and scores, all kinds of exclusive content. You can win prizes and much more. It's a Lobo Sports app. It's free. Find it in the Apple and Google stores. Download it now and go Lobos. 37 to 36, Aggies in front. We're courtside on Albertson's radio row in the pit. Alok catches the inbound for New Mexico State and flips it out top to Allen. Allen with 14 points and seven rebounds to lead everybody in those categories. He drives it right down the teeth of the defense. He has the ball stripped by Singleton, but he gets it back and he lays it in. And the Aggies have their biggest lead. And they, they just got whistled for delay of game. But I tell you what, Allen could have gotten whistled for taunting. But he's doing a great job of getting the ball inside. Since halftime, they've scored 12 points in the paint. And some of that's just half court, transition. Got to stop the ball from getting in the paint. Two long runouts. Yep. Lobos down by three. Biggest advantage for the Aggies, 39-36. Straight on three for Jay Allen. Tobar, back rim no good. Rebound tap by Singleton, but one by Allen for New Mexico State. Ahead to Rice. Rice. His pass stolen by Singleton. Great anticipation by Saquon. Mashburn gets it to Saquon. Saquon on a rim run. Saquon with a scoop and score. That ends an 8-0 Aggie run. 39-38 NMSU. Here come the pit faithful. Pryor on ball guarded by House. Pryor off the screen. Pryor to the rim. Layup is good. Too easy. Again, Ag is getting to the rim. Pryor has four. Lobos down three once again. House pulls up in the free throw circle to the right wing to Singleton. Saquon nice between defenders. Lost it, got it back. He's on the baseline left. Backs his man down. Offensive foul on Saquon. Put his left shoulder into the defender. And Peak went down and drew the charge. Mexico State. 13.57 to go in the game. KJ Jenkins once in for UNF. KJ will check in. Jalen House will check out. Mashburn. Jenkins, Singleton, Johnson, Alan Tobar for UNF. Allen, Pryor, Rice, Peak, and Alock. Fred of SU. Alock catches at the top of the arc. Double hand off to Rice. Now to Peak between the wheels. 
He gives it up to Allen. Allen backs it out with 15 to shoot. Hands it off to Rice. Chance of defense come up from UNM. Rice tries a three. Missed it. Rebound for Singleton. And a flop warning on Rice for the Aggies. Rice took the three. He was touched after the release. He went down, and he got called for a team flop warning. Yep. Now, if they called that flop early on in the game, Hunter, that would have been, would have been a technical free throw. Mashburn catches in the backcourt and brings it into the forecourt with the left hand dribble. 13 and a half minutes to go. Mash behind the back bounce. Mash down the left lane line. Mash steps back and banks it home. Beautiful shot off the window from 12 feet. Robos within one. 41 to 40. And MSU. Now the pitch crowd stands. And with another stop. Prior on the left wing checked by Jenkins. Jenkins fights over top of the screen. To the right corner for an open A lock three. It's an air ball. And Peak with a rebound. He went to the floor. No travel call. A missed layup by Rice. And then a missed put back dunk by A lock. Lobos have it with a chance to take the lead. Pull up Jay. It's good. PJ Jenkins in the free throw circle from 18. Lobos 42. And MSU 41. Now Dave Hall, veteran official, will bring Alan Tobar and Rice together to talk to them. Free game in the pit. Don't want to let this one get away no. from you. Well, Officiating these, these crew. Are, yeah, these are veteran. Irving and Dave Hall. I know you're able to touch base with Dave before the game. Always comes over and says hello. I can't believe it, me. He officiated when I played. Prior into the front court for the Aggies. Lobos by one. 12 and a half to go. Alok bangs into Alan Tovar and scores a jump hook from the Mountain West logo. Alok, another Aggie transfer. It's a big shot. Aggies by one. Mashburn kicks it to Tovar. Fakes the three. Drive. Jay Allen tries to dunk. It goes! And one! Gets it to roll in, and one opportunity. Takes the contact. a -lock second is the Aggies' third in the half. The dunk didn't go in on the first try, or rolled back over the heel and down. And now Alan Tovar looking for the old-fashioned three-point play. Wow. In and out. Rebound a -lock. Lobos have not shot the free throws as well as they'd like so far today. Three of seven. 44-43 New Mexico, 12.05 left. Pryor refuses the screen. Pryor sprints past his man and plows for a two-hand dunk from Peak. Aggies by one. Mashburn crossing over. Mashburn leaves it for Tovar. Tovar leans in and scores. Contact once again, there but no goes. call. And a flop has been called on Peak. Yes. So the second flop called on New Mexico State gives UNM a technical free throw. Lobos up 46 to 45. We've got timeout on court. 11.47 to go in the game. Lobos will take that technical free throw when we return. UNM up by one, 46 to 45. Inside the 12 minute mark on the UNM Sports Radio Network. Hey Lobos, and your new Senda Visa debit card or credit card to your mobile wallet. Make payments to anyone, anywhere, anytime, safely and securely. Learn more at newsenda.org slash digital dash wallet. You said the credit union, the power of we. 46 to 45, Lobos lead the Aggies. 11.47 to go in the game. We're on Albertson's Radio Row. Just a few rows from the court sits Rick Pitino, the legendary both collegiate and NBA head coach. Talked to him earlier today, Hunter, at the Lobos shoot-around. He's here to watch his son coach the Lobos. His Iona team is on an extended break. And I asked him when he was last in Albuquerque. Didn't even blink. 2005, <laughs> that's the year that they won the regional and went to the final four at Louisville. Rice lobs it inside. McCann's reverse layup good for the Aggies. Again. Lobos have to keep the ball out of the paint. The Aggies are scoring at will at the rim. 
That ties it at 47. Mashburn made the technical free throw coming out of the timeout to give the Lobos a two-point lead. Johnson, skip pass to Tovar. Top of the wheel triple for Jay Allen. Short, rebounded by Saquon. Saved it inbounds to House. 12 to shoot for UNM. Plenty of time on this shot clock. Allen Tovar screens for House. House crosses over. Rice's left elbow jump shot. Back rim no good. Long rebound to Allen. Allen likes to go. Allen on House. Euro step. Knocks House down. Scores, but it's an offensive foul. Great job of House getting back, getting in position, and taking the charge. And that's where the Aggies have been hurting the Lobos in transition. Got to get back and stop the ball. Second foul on Allen. Fourth on New Mexico State. Lobos have committed two and a half. 11 minute mark. Second half action from the pit. House has it in the center circle. Luskin has just checked back in. Screens for Jalen. Jalen got the switch. They skip it to Singleton. Singleton. Hard drive. Knocks oh. down on Aggie. Offensive foul on Singleton. I'm not sure Pryor had position. He was still backpedaling. So Pryor takes the hit and gets the call. Turnover for Singleton and a personal foul on Saquon. It's his second. Team's third, 47-47 tie. 10.35 left in the game. Rice curls and catches, top of the arc. Three ball up the Pryor feed, no good. Long rebound the house. Jalen into the front court. Crossing over on McCants. Had it stripped, it goes right to Muscadet. Jethro rises, elbow jump shot. Rims out, rebound the cans for the Aggies. They whip it ahead to Rice. Rice oh. gets it to Alock, <laughs> and then Muskinen lands on top of Alock off the shot fake. Jethro grabbed the rim to yeah. avoid a horrible collision. Oh, a coach is yelling at Muskinen because he's arguing with the ref, asking for the foul as his man streaks down the court for a layup. Shot fake by Alock, and Muskinen was literally sitting on his shoulder at the rim. Good idea. 14 yeah. fouls on both. Grab that rim. Inbounded here to Allen. Allen crossing the key. Allen falling away. Can't convert. I think Singleton got a piece of it. Allen thought he was fouled and loose basketball draws a loose ball foul. It's going to be on Muskeden. Muskeden's third is the team's fifth. 10 09 left and a half. 47-47 time. We're in second half action. Albuquerque Downs Racetrack and Casino winning entertainment. It includes simulcast racing, live music, dining, the best games, and more. Albuquerque Downs Racetrack and Casino. Prior inbounds with a 20-second shot clock for New Mexico State. To McCants. Now to Rice between the circle. Right wing beyond the arc to Allen. Faces up on Singleton. Alok comes to screen. On the switch, Muskin, and now on Allen. Allen will back it way out with five to shoot. Deep straight on triple. Left iron, no good. Rebound, Mashburn for UNM. 47-47 time. Whip it ahead to Singleton. Saquon, knifing inside. Saquon, scoop. Rattles off, but he's fouled. Saquon to the foul line. It's first, team's fifth. And Singleton, one for one of the stripe tonight. Two Saquon. Right iron, no good. Singleton came in, two for four. Check it, three for nine at the strike. So four for 10 before that foul shot. Now four for 11. Another one on the way for Saquon. Front iron and good. Splits the fair, he's two for three tonight. 48, 47, Lobos by one. 940 left. Aggies have it in the front court. Alok catches on the left block. Foul away from the ball. It's going to be on Mashburn. Mashburn with the hold, his second, team sixth. Williams checks in for New Mexico State. 9.33 left as Pryor gets a breather for Coach James. Bubbles up one, 48-47. Rice looks to key it in, lobs it out front to Allen. Allen at the elbow, rises for a jump shot, and scores Allen with 18. He's 9 of 17 from the field. 25. Lobos trail 49 to 48. 
Ball screen for House. House finds the cutting Singleton. His layup, no good, but a foul. And Saquon will go back to the free throw line. McCants picks up another personal, his fourth. Aggie sixth, and McCants will have to go sit. Dogged McCants in Las Cruces back on Tuesday. Played just over 14 minutes. And just four points. Singleton's first free throw is good. We're going to shoot free throws for the final nine minutes and 13 seconds, Hunter. Both teams with 16 fouls. That's right. Saquon Singleton, a 50% free thrower a season to go. Second one on the way. Back rim, no good. Split the pair. Saquon, three for five from the foul line tonight. 49-49 tie as the Aggies rebound his miss. Franks into the front court for the Mexico State. To the corner to Williams. Back out front to Rice, who crossed over off the Allen Street. On the switch, has Singleton on him. Singleton fights over the screen this time. Whip to the corner to Williams. Williams leaves it for Alock on the drive, and Alock lays it in. A nice find by Williams. 40 points in the paint. 51 to 49, New Mexico State. House has it with 15 on the shot clock. Muskinen screens for Jalen. Finds the screener, Muskinen, Muskinen to the reverse. It's rejected. Loose ball won by Muskinen. He rises and he's fouled by Elon. Muskinen with free. So far tonight, Hunter, the Lobos have shot a dozen free throws. The Aggies just three. But the Lobos are six for 12 from the line. A team that came into the game shooting the free throws at 76%. 37% floor shooting for the Lobos. 44% for the Aggies. Neither team is making the three ball. No. Lobos five of 18, Aggies two of 14. No, no. Thought the foul was on Alon, but it was not. The foul was on Williams. They went and checked and changed the foul. First free throw for Muskinen, rims out. Jenkins checks in from Ashburn. For New Mexico. Second free throw upcoming for Muskinen. Nice deep breath, no bounce. Jethro fires it, knocks it down. Splits the pair, NMSU 51, Lobos 50. Muskinen goes one out of two, Lobos are seven of 14 at the strike. 8-10 to go in the game. Aggie ball in the front court. Rice whips it down on the block to Alon. Backing down Muskinen. Now leaning in past Muskinen. Scores and a chance for Dan Wong. Muskinen just picked up his fourth. You can see New Mexico State's strategy in the second half is really to get the ball inside, whether it's dribble drive or post up the bigs. And, of course, it's been working. This is their biggest lead of the game. Three points. The 8.05 mark here in the second half. Muskinen checks out. Jail Tovar checks back in. Muskinen with four fouls goes to Coach Patino's bench. Alok's free throw over the top of the backboard. Bounces off the iron and out of play. Alok, a transfer from both TCU and Coppin State. Played at Coppin State a season ago. His last campaign with TCU was back in 2018 2019. Young man from Auckland, New Zealand, but born in Kenya. Lobos trail by three. Inside eight minutes mark. House crossing over. House lobbing. Singleton layup. No good on the reverse. Rebounded by Rice. Aggies have it in the front court to Allen. Allen working on Saquon. Stepping back. Now driving the left rail. Leading in. Banks hit home. Allen with 20. Aggies by five. It is the grinder game that Coach Jans in New Mexico State would want, and they have their biggest lead. Lobos led by 10 in the first half. Lobos need a bucket. Haven't scored a field goal in four minutes. House to the rim and draws a foul, and Jalen will step to the free throw line. The whistle goes on to Mexico State, and we'll take timeout. 7.25 to go in the game. Aggies 55, Lobos 50 on the UNF. House had 11 points at intermission. He is stuck on 11 points. 
We sit courtside on Albertson's radio row. And the free throw goes for House. That's his first point in the second half. And we're at the seven and a half minute mark. House can draw his team within a possession with another free throw make. It's good. 55-52 NMSU. The Aggies have fully seven more field goal makes in the second half than do the Lobos. 14 to seven since intermission. Rice comes to get the basketball and he'll control the point guard position for NMSU. Allen, Rice, Pete, Williams, and Alock for the Aggies. Jenkins, Mashburn, House, Johnson, and Allen Tovar for the Lobos. Rice picks up the dribble on the angle left, looks for some help. He's in trouble. Pass to the left block to Alock. Allen Tovar on his back. Alock spinning. Alock firing. Jump hook no good. Rebound Allen Tovar. Got to stop inside. That's what they got to do. Right now the Aggies just pounding it inside. Lobos could tie with a triple. KJ feeds Mashburn, right wing high beyond the yard. Catching between the wheels, Jenkins now. Alan Tovar screens for KJ. KJ down the left rail, leans in. Left hand scoop is good. KJ Jenkins, not just a jump shooter. Lobos within one. Four straight for UMM. 55, 54, Aggie, six and a half to go. Allen out between the circles, 15 to shoot. Finds the screening, a -lock. he scores with a chance for Dan Brown. KJ Jenkins tried to draw the charge and could not. Yeah, he was inside the wrist. That would have been a charge. KJ's feet right on the restricted circle line. Good eyes, partner. 57-54, Aggies. It's that time again, fans, TLC's heating experts. They can make your own the ultimate comfort zone when you need your heater service called TLC. A-lock free throw, rims in. Aggies by four. They've made five of the last six field goals in the Aggies have. House walks it into the front court, brings it to the left wing. Off the screen from Mashburn, he's on the baseline. Beautiful spin dribble by Jalen. He scores and he's fouled! Strong man pose for House, and one opportunity. I was just gonna say, House and Mashburn were kind of quiet. First half, they had 21 points. Here in the second half, they had a total of eight between them. Chance for a three-point play the old-fashioned way for Jalen. He was just at the line a moment ago and made two. It's up. It's good. Lobos within one. Aggies 58. New Mexico 57. Here comes the pit crowd. I'm guessing more than 13,000 tonight. Pryor with the ball. Pryor working on house. Pryor leading in. Pryor scoring right hand layup. Right lane line drive for Pryor. Aggies by three, 60 to 57. 540 going again. Whistle yeah, away from the ball. Yep. It's on Allen. Allen's third. Tenth on New Mexico State. Double bonus to rest away for the Lobos. Jamal Mashburn will step to the line. Mashburn and House lead their team with 16 points apiece. Mash's first free throw is a switch. Mashburn an 81% free throw. House an 82% free throw. When those guys are at the line, you like your chances. Oh, yeah. And they get there a lot. The two Lobos who shoot the most free throws. Mash bet on house, their top two scorers. Mash's second free throw also a switch. The man who coached his father, Rick Patino, stands with a pit crowd here in Albuquerque, watching his son Richard coach Jamal Mashburn Jr. in the Lobos. Pryor off the ball screen. Pryor feeds right wing to Rice. Entry pass knocked away by Alan Tovar. Aggies still have 13 to shoot. Nice deflection by Tovar. 523 to go. This is where the wings need to pressure the passers so that the bigs, it's not easy. It's not all on Tovar trying to, you know, to guard the post. 60 to 59, Aggies. They throw it away. This will be an over and back. Pryor with a turnover. A terrible inbounds pass. Great defense by the Lobos denying. 
Yankees have turned it over 13 times the Lobos nine. I have a feeling this is going to go down to the wire. <laughs> 60 to 59 NMSU. Down to the 515 mark. Chance of let's go Lobos from the faithful. Rising left elbow extended. Ashburn knocks down an 18 footer. Mash with an even 20. Lobos up 61 to 16. Allen on the take. Allen cut off and doubled. Throws it out to Pryor. 15 on the shot timer for the Aggies. Pryor drive it on house. Gets it to Peak. Peak back to Pryor. 10 to shoot. Pryor at the free throw circle. Leans in. Right hand runner. No good. Rebound Allen Tobar for UNM. Coach Patino pounding the floor with his right palm. <laughs> 61 to 60 Lobos. Four and a half to go. Everybody's standing. Johnson <laughs> screening for Mashburn. Mash stepped it out. Working on Allen. Drives past Allen. Layup rejected. Contact no call. Aggie balls tough. Allen into the key. Allen to the left baseline. Travel. No call. He dragged his pivot foot. They swallowed the whistle. 61 to 60. Lobos. 4-10 to go. Hesitation bounced by Rice. Rice loses his footing, but leaves it for McNair. McNair lays it in. Aggies up one. 62 to 61. It's who executes down the stretch over the final four minutes. House at the front. Now to Mashman who gets it right corner to Jenkins. Jab step by KJ. KJ into the key. Whips it right baseline. Three on the way for Alan Tovar. It's short. Rebound McNair. Aggie ball. With a one point lead. Tovar. 0 for 5 from the three. Allen has it. Wants Johnson. Allen drives on Johnson. Rises. Runner short. Rebound. Allen Tovar. Good shot by Johnson. Defending. 6 6. Javante. Yep. Great defense. Mashburn off the Allen Tobar ball screen. Follows Allen Tobar to the rim and lays it in. Mashburn with 22. Lobos up one, 63 to 62. New Mexico State will take timeout. 3.07 to go. 63 to 62. UNM up by one. We pause. Lobo basketball on the UNM Sports Radio Network. We're back on Albertson's Radio Road, courtside in University Arena. The pit is alive for the Rio Grande rivalry. Lobo 63, Aggie 62, 3.07 left. UNM Athletics and Valley Pits proud partners trying to end hunger throughout New Mexico for every football sack, men's basketball block shot, and baseball strikeout by a Lobo pitcher. Valley Pits donates to the Roadrunner Group. Valley Pits, the official fencing partner of UNM Athletics. With Lobo all-time great Hunter Green, I'm Robert Pornoy, and this is what we came for, Hunter. Yeah. What a basketball game. Oh, and guys aren't shooting the ball well, but I tell you what, they're battling out there defensively. The Lobos foul shooting has improved. They're getting the right guys to the, the line, line here down exactly. the stretch in house in Mashburn. And it has been the foul line that has helped bring the Lobos back from a five-point deficit. UNM leads by one. Aggies inbound in the backcourt to Pryor. Pryor lobs it top of the circle to McCants. McCants playing with four fouls. Spinning pass, Tovar, layup short. Pryor had two hands on the loose ball. It's off his hands and out of bounds. Lobo basketball. Tell you what, Tovar stepped up his game defensively down low. He's been guarding, keeping the bigs out of there. With Muskinen in foul trouble, Alan Tovar asked to play the five with Emmanuel Quach out available, and he's doing yeoman's work. Jenkins on the left wing. Nearly lost it, got it back. 18 to shoot. The Lobos lead New Mexico State 63 to 62. Devontae Johnson will inbound in the front court, just to the left of our broadcast position. Throws it way into the backcourt to Jalen House, and the Lobos can set it up. They have 15 to shoot as House brings it through the center circle. House down the center of the key. House floater comes up short. Rebound McCants, but he loses the basketball out of bounds on the end line. Two and a half minutes left. The officials confirm. Was that a shot attempt? I think that's what they're trying to figure out. Is there a new shot clock? The 20. Okay. What it was was a change of possession or not. That's the thing you're trying to decide, right? 
it was a change of possession, you'd think the Lobos would get a third. Full get a 30. 30. Yeah. yeah. McCann secured the basketball, and then he lost his footing and fell out of bounds. Mashburn catches the inbound. Baseline left. Spins past Rice. Gets nice. into the key. Head Hangs up and under. Nice. Scoop and score. Mashburn with 24. Yeah, it's got to be in Mashburn's hands or house here the last two minutes. 65 to 62, Lobos. 2.10 left. They enter into McCants, backing down Tovar. Knocks Tovar down and scores. No call. Flop warning on Jay Allen Tovar. That's the first one on UNM. Or is it the second? It's the first. It is the first. For a moment, I thought they were walking to the other end, but it is the first. So the next one would be a technical free throw for New Mexico State. Correct. Lobos lead at 65-64. Mashburn with the ball, the 205 mark. Waits for the Allen Tovar ball screen. Mash to the free throw circle. The house in the left corner. Jalen with a shot play. Fake. He drives and backs it out. Keeps the dribble alive. And House brings it out between the wheels. Throws it right corner to Allen Tovar. Baseline jumper. Good! Jay Allen Tovar scores an 18-footer. Lobos 67. The Mexico State 64. And that's really his range. You know, the three-point... Line is tough for him, but man, that little 15-footer, he can knock it down. Pryor has it for the Aggies. A minute and a half left. Now McCants on the right wing beyond the arc. To the top to Rice. 10 to shoot. Rice down the right rail, spinning, firing, falling away. No good. 12 feet. Rebound. KJ Jenkins for New Mexico. Boy, a huge possession for UNM to make it a two-possession game with a score. 110 left. Lobos in the double bonus. Mashburn will run shot clock. One minute to go. Shot clock down to 10. Alan Tovar screens for a match. Mash bounces that baseline. Johnson jump shot. Oh. Rips out. Rebound Rice. Good look from 15 feet. Aggie ball. 45 seconds to go. McCants has it at the top. Finds the back door oh, cut man. by Rice, and Rice lays it in. Timeout, Coach Chance and NMSU. The Lobos line up in the center circle. Yeah, he wants to pick up at half court. The Aggies set up their pressure. They leave the inbounder unguarded. Gonna... Lobos get it to House. House into the front court, up the near wing. Hands it off to Mashburn. Ten seconds separating shot clock and game clock. 15 to shoot for UNM. Mashburn has Rice on him. Backs it out to the center circle. Down to 10 on the shot clock. 20 on the game clock. Mash will start his play with seven seconds. Gets past Rice. Feeds Johnson in the corner. Javante leans in. Big shot, no good, but Javante draws contact and he'll shoot free throw. The foul's gonna go on peak, his fourth. And Javante Johnson with the two biggest free throws of his life. 0 for 1 at the stripe so far tonight. The sophomore from Colorado Springs. Could make it a three-point game. First free throw on the way. Front iron, glass, and bounces out. One more for Javante. To make it a two-point lead for UNM. 12 seconds left. Substitution coming for Coach Stans and NMSU. Alock will check in, Peak will check out. Lobos will counter, Singleton checks in for New Mexico. Jenkins will check out. One more free throw coming for Johnson. Javante. I think Coach brought Singleton in to rebound, right? And Longer defense body. on the other yeah, end as exactly. well. Exactly. Yep. Second free throw on the way for Javante is a swish. Lobos 68, Aggies 66. 12 seconds left. No timeout call here for Coach Jans. He has one in his pocket. Oh, into the front court, Pryor. Pryor whips it to McCants on the baseline. McCants to the rim. Lays it in. 3.7 seconds left. Right, Coach right. Patino wants timeout. He could run the floor. KJ looks to get it into House right now. Pryor is fronting House. House will catch. House sprinting across the timeline. Two seconds. One second. He throws it up. And it's off the right iron. No good. We'll go to overtime. A pretty good look Got on the runner. runner there. That's all you can ask for. And it was 
probably a 15, 20 footer. We'll take time out, 68-68, we go to OT. Lobo basketball on the UNM Sports Radio Network. We'll jump center, McCants and Allen Tobon. Lobos will head right to left for the extra period. Alan Tovar flips it into the backcourt to Jalen House, and the Lobos have the first possession of OT. House gives it up to Johnson. Javante hands it off to Singleton. Now House comes back and gets it between the circles. House crossing over on Alock off the switch. Back to that and resets. Rises. Three pointer straight on. Three ball. Jalen House. Lobos up by three, 71 to 68. House with 19. Four and a half to go in the pit in overtime. Pride of McCann to the top. McCann's lob entry to A lock on the baseline. He's on the left block. Alan Tovar guards it. A lock jump hook. Good. A lock with 15. He's given his coach some great bench minutes. Tovar's got to get some help. Guy's got to double down, dig on him. A lock is so long at 6'11. House was bumped, no call. House still working to Mashburn at the top. Mash has Rice on him. 12 to shoot. Mash kicks it left corner. One two of our three. Air ball. Weak side rebound. Johnson. Five to shoot for UNM. The cutter is House. House floater off the back rim. Rebound McCants. And House came down hard. Jalen's got to get up and get back in it. He's going to try. Left corner three on the way for Teddy Allen. In and out. Rebound Johnson. And we've got an injury timeout. Jalen House favoring the left ankle. Wearing those low cuts. So, after the Lobos got back on the court for practice, after taking a day off following the 101-94 win on Tuesday in Cruces, House did tweak the ankle the first day of practice back midweek. He was just fine through treatment and practice getting ready for this contest, but something happened there, and Jalen goes to the Lobo bench. Singleton has it out high. Mashburn will run the show now for New Mexico. Mash whipped it to Singleton. Singleton driving the left baseline. No look feed to Allen Tovar. He's rejected by McCants on the dunk attempt. Aggie ball. Nice look by Singleton. Rice. Shot fake on the three, drag the pivot foot. The Lover fans wanted to call, don't get it. McCants lob entry to A-Lock over Mashburn on the switch and lays it in. And the Aggies lead it, 72 to 71, four straight for NMSU. Mashburn through the center circle. To Singleton on the right wing. Back to Mash out high with 20 to shoot. Alan Tovar screens for Mash. Mash rises, left elbow. Jump shot from 15 off the right iron. Stop Rebound the ball. Allen. Aggie ball. Here's Pryor out high. Two and a half left. Chance of defense from the Lobo fans. Aggie triple could make it a two possession game. Alock screens for Pryor. McCants catches at the top. They're looking to set up Alock on the block again and said he'll come and screen for Allen. Allen working on Singleton down the left baseline. Singleton blocked it! Loose not ball sure, foul. Not sure if that's a good thing. Singleton. It's going to be on Allen. It's two shots. So Singleton will go to the other end and shoot free throws. The fourth personal on Teddy Allen, and Jalen House is going to check back in for UNM. And Saquon's got to muster up all the courage and all the strength to book two really big free throws right here. Singleton three for five on the night. Remember, shot at 50% at the line a year ago. First one for Saquon. Banks in. Lobos will take it. Tied at 72. Saquon nods the head. Mashburn gives him a vote of confidence. Saquon gets one more. Muscadin checks in for J. Allen Tovar for New Mexico. Another free throw for Singleton to give the Lobos the lead. 2.13 left. And House, if it is a make here, will check back in. Saquon free throw is strong. Rebounded by Rice. House will have to wait. Aggie possession tied at 72. Down to 2.05 left as Pryor brings it into the front court for New Mexico State. McCants catches with his 4,000 and gives it back to Pryor in the Lobo Shield logo at the top. Now to McCants. McCants with a pass fake. McCants down the right rail. Pump fake. Leaner scores it from the right block. 
McCants gives NMSU a 74 to 72 lead. 145 left. Mashburn into the front court for UNM. Mash off the Muscat and ball screen. Now to Jenkins out top. To the right wing to Singleton. Singleton slashing, kicking. Jenkins, left wing three. Back rim, no good. Long rebound won by Mashburn. To Singleton and back to Mash. To left wing to KJ. KJ with a jab step. Now KJ with a drive. And KJ is called for the offensive foul. New Mexico State takes the charge. Pryor took the hit and drew the call. Third on KJ. Ninth on Maggie 74, Lobo 72. And a huge defensive possession for URM. Aggies with another chance to make it a two possession game. Pryor across the timeline. To Rice at the top. McCants Whipped it inside of McCants. McCants cross key feed to Alock. Alock has Muskin on his back. Jump hook for Alock is good. Alock has been their star. 19 points off the bench. Towards the Mexico State yeah. leads by four. 76 72. House with the ball. House off the Muskin in screen. Jalen, step back, left elbow, Jay. Good! <laughs> Coach Patino wants timeout. 76 to 74. Aggies by two, 48 seconds to go. A ton of basketball left. I mean, he's, he totally agreed. His first free throw bounced off the heel of the rim and went over the oh, top of the right. backboard. That's yeah. right. Yeah, but prior to that, he hadn't shot a free throw all year. Made the second one, and it wasn't all that pretty. I'm trying to find a percentage, partner. <laughs> no percentage. It's 50. He's 50 percent over the, for the year. One he didn't have two. one coming in. Yeah. 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 One of two tonight. <laughs> one of two for the year. <laughs> You're thinking like a coach. I like oh, it. Oh yeah. All right. Lobos will pressure the inbound on the backboard. Aggies get it to Pryor. 45 ticks on the game clock. 27 on the shot clock. Here we go. Lobos down two, 76-74. McCann to the top of New Mexico State. His bounce pass to the back, cutting Rice. Hits the stanchion out of bounds. Turnover. Lobo possession with the chance to tie or take the lead. It's entered to Mashburn in the backcourt. Mashburn through the center circle. Mashburn backs it out. Five seconds separating shot and game clock. Mashburn there rising, left there elbow, is. jump shot is good off the dribble. 76, 76 time. Oh, so Aggies good, two off timeouts. the dribble, off the dribble. Deadly off the dribble. Coach Jeff will take right. timeout. Yep. Remember the Aggies brought it across the timeline before calling timeout, so they will be able to inbound in the front court. They can also pitch it into the backcourt again if they so choose. The Aggies will enter it in front of their bench to our right. Rice will key it in for New Mexico State. Rosen yeah, into the backcourt to Pryor. 15 seconds to go as Pryor walks it through the Lobo Shield logo at center court. Alock screens for Pryor. How spikes over top. To Rice at the top now with seven to shoot. Rice has Mashburn guarding him. Rice with a jab step. Rice will go on the take. Rice spins to a double team. Feeds Pryor. His reverse layup is oh. good as time expires. Oh, and the Aggie bench empties out on court. New Mexico State thinks it is won 78 to 76. They will check the video to make sure the shot was off in time. Yeah, I thought it would. I thought he had enough time there. This would be the second consecutive last second win for New Mexico State against UNM. And now Aggie players stomping on the Lobo Shield logo and scratching with the soles of their shoes on the Shield logo. And Coach Jans races out to center court to get the Aggies off the paint. And Lobo athletic director Eddie Nunez got right in the face of Coach Jans to tell him that is not acceptable. The shot has been ruled good, and the game is over. Coach Jans, I'm sure, in his final comments to Coach Patino, apologized for his players' behavior at the end of the game. The shot counts, and now Jabari Rice is taunting the New Mexico faithful across the court from us. 
Rice was the man who made the game-winning shot against UTEP a couple of nights back in their rivalry matchup against the Miners. Final score, New Mexico State 78, UNM 76. The reverse layup counts, and the Aggies go to the split. Yeah, it was a basically a loose ball. Pryor picks it up, throws it over his right shoulder on a reverse layup. And the Aggies are going to hear it from this crowd as they head back to the locker room. New Mexico State 78, Lobo 76 is the final. What a finish in overtime here in the pit. We're back with the post-game show after this timeout. It's Lobo.